Hey guys, welcome to episode three of Sherry Week. Hey, Sherry Week, what an idea. Uh, I, sometimes I think I might be a little bit crazy for taking this on, but I hope you guys are enjoying uh, seven days of Sherry, seven videos in a row. And uh, hey, uh, today we're going to continue with a clip from Sherry's second ever video with me. Uh, you could tell in this one, uh, she feels a little more comfortable in front of the camera. And uh, But one of my viewers came up with a really straightforward and to the point question. And guess what? Her answer was really straightforward and to the point. And I think that's one of the things that really endeared Sherry to the viewers. This particular video had 44,000 views and it really put her on the map as far as uh, coin shop owners who come on YouTube. And uh, so, hey, without any further ado, uh, let me stop hyping it up and get straight to it. But first, one quick uh, reminder, this uh, bar right here is on the line. Uh, that's a little uh, image that I uh, grabbed off my video, my first one with Sherry, where she decided to give away a five ounce vintage bar. Hey, details about that will be at the end. So enjoy today's episode. Here we go. Hey, I am walking into the collector's gallery. Hey, you know this is gonna be a good one. I'm interviewing Sherry once again. Hit that like button if you're new, subscribe, and hey, while you're at it, be sure to hit that notification bell. Enjoy. 2 Hello, Silver fans. This is T, and you're in the place to be for silver education, acquisition, and entertainment. And hey, the place to be is Collector's Gallery in Oak Forest, Illinois. Here's Sherry. Okay, hey, thank you, Sherry, for coming back on my show. Uh, uh, the last video I made with you was extremely popular. Well, thank you for having me again. I know I've had a ton of calls and responses in regards to this, so I'm very excited. Yeah, it's got like 10,000 uh, views, and uh, uh, you may have a fan club for me. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm sure people can find a better fan club to... <laughs> to join as far as that's concerned. Well, everybody thinks you're awesome, and they really appreciated your honesty in the last one. Uh, you know, a lot of times on uh, programs like this, people just want to tune in and hear what they want to hear, mm -hmm. and I like how you, you know, shoot from the hip and uh, just tell it like you see it, you know? Honesty, and, and that's the most important thing in this business. If you if you don't have that, then you're not going to be able to trust the person that you're dealing with, so doesn't do much for me to be a dishonest person if I want to keep my fan base and my, my customer base. Absolutely. Okay, uh, let me jump into this. Uh, I had uh, a post yesterday. I invited people to uh, ask questions. And um, so this basically this whole video is going to be viewer questions. Okay. I may interject here or there or, or ask for a little more of a thorough answer, but uh, I want to dedicate this one to the viewers. Okay. And the very first one, uh, we're not messing around. We're not uh, holding back any punches. Uh, Mutant Skipper asked a question, and he prefaced it by serious question. He wants to know... And some people in the comment section didn't even think I would ask this. They okay. think they thought I was just going to throw a bunch of softballs at you. Okay. But let me ask you straight up: Why should people support an LCS? I've got a bunch of my own answers, but from your mouth, why do you think people should support their local coin shop? Wouldn't people feel more comfortable going into a local coin shop to hold something in their hand instead of buying something offline and they don't know for sure what it is that they're getting? That, that makes the most sense to me for people to feel comfortable especially new people getting into collecting or wanting to invest you, you want to feel comfortable with what it is that you're actually doing and what it is that you're what you're purchasing for your hard-earned money That's so it. going into a local coin shop is your best bet to begin with you know even if you decide ultimately that you're, you're going to do all of your business online mm -hmm. you still want to feel comfortable with what it is that you're purchasing to begin with so go into your local coin shop hold it in your hand look at it, talk to somebody, get a feel for what it is that you're, the questions that you need answer, look somebody in the eye. Mm -hmm. You know, looking a computer in the eye doesn't give you as much information as, as being in person with somebody would. Yes, uh, I agree. And uh, there's probably not a single person watching this who has done a fair amount of online shopping, who hasn't received something 
that they weren't quite satisfied with. Right. And they saw some, a picture online, they thought they were getting X, and they got Y in, right. the, ma in the mailbox, and they had some level of disappointment. Of and course. then you either live with it, or you gotta ship it back, right. and that can be a pain in the neck. Right. Hopefully the company you're dealing with has a, a honorable return policy, so mm -hmm. that if you do purchase something that you're not happy with, that, that you're able to do that. You yeah. know, that's the other thing with your local coin shop. You're you're looking at what it is that you're purchasing first. So mm -hmm. you can decide, yes, I do want to purchase that. No, I don't want to purchase it. You're holding it in your hand. You're seeing it before. You're taking out your checkbook, okay? Mm -hmm. You know what it is that you're getting. Sure. And uh, I, I like the idea of supporting my local community. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, you, wherever you live, you want your community be, to be strong. You want the businesses in your community mm -hmm. to be strong. Uh, that's another reason uh, for me as well, but probably my biggest sherry, and this is why I travel all around like a lunatic going to different coin shops, mm -hmm. is I like to find uh, treasures that were unexpected. Yeah. And, you know, I, I could be sorting through a generic bin and find something that I just could, can't believe yeah. that I found. So yeah. you find these little treasures here and there. Uh, online, you see what you get, and mm -hmm. you know that's that's basically it. It's just what's there available. No surprises. No, that's why I love doing what I do. I never know what's going to walk in the door. I'm surprised by something. I, I learn new information every single day. There's always something new to be learned, and especially when you're in a live environment. Okay, yeah. when you're on the computer, I'm not bashing computer sales. I, I don't don't get me wrong. I'm not bashing that. Yeah. You could save a buck, you know, going online. That's true. But sure. uh, I guess another thing for me is I like the culture of a coin shop. I like walking in. I like talking coins and bullying. Uh, I like listening to other people's conversation. Yep. It's just fun. So I guess for me, there's a little bit of a entertainment value. It's not, it's more than just a just a business transaction. It's uh, you know something that I really enjoy doing. Yep. Me All too. Right. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, hopefully Mutant Skipper is uh, satisfied with hopefully, that response. Hopefully, hopefully. Uh, how about... Hey guys, uh, welcome back to the old coin cave. Uh, hey, I hope you could tell by that video that uh, not only was Sherry very, very straightforward about her answers, uh, but I personally am very passionate about supporting local coin shops. So whether you have a great coin shop in your town or <laughs> or these videos or where you get your fix of local coin shop flavor, uh, hey, glad you're here. Now, back to those contest rules. It's pretty simple. There is going to be seven videos in total. This is number three in Sherry Week. So it's basically like this. Every single video this week, these out of these seven, that you watch, like, and share. And don't forget, you've got to be a subscriber. And then come back on the comments and tell me you've shared. And this will be strictly on the honor system. Hey, that is your entry into the giveaway. So, hey, good luck, everybody, and thanks for watching. Now, if you wanted to see the complete version and the other subsequent questions and answers that came after that first really great question, the rest of them turned out to be really great as well. All you have to do is click on through right here, and if you're watching on your phone, just tap right there. Tap right on that video and you'll go on through and you'll get a chance to watch the whole thing. All right, everybody. Thanks for watching. Cheers.